Hi guys, so today is a very exciting day. I'm going to get my nails done. Well, they didn't, they weren't able to get me in for um, my nails, so I'm just going to do press on kiss nails, French manicure, and then I am getting a pedicure done today with my best friend Luana, who you guys have seen before. The exciting news is that today I'm gonna be shopping with Luana for my graduation dress. I did order one online, but I have gained some weight since ordering it, and I do not think I am that size anymore, unfortunately. Saturday I'm taking pictures with my friends from school, and yesterday was officially my last day of school. I took my last exam. I am officially done and I graduated. And this semester, I don't know how I did it, but I got all six A's. So I'm very, very happy. I don't, I really don't know how it happened, but I managed to pull it out. Like I told you guys in the last video, I was just feeling very discouraged, especially because the first time I did the HESI, I didn't pass it. But a few days ago, I took it the second time and I passed it. So today is very important. I absolutely have to find a dress and I wanted to take you guys with me to find it as well as the shoes. I have some cute white shoes that I could wear that's like the backup if I can't find anything today. But I was kind of hoping for something a little bit more chunky. Um, I also have more exciting news, but I'm going to save that for a different video, I think, because today I just really want to focus on next week and graduating. And yeah, I'm just happy that I was able to tell you guys something good, <laughs> something positive. I feel like my last video was so negative. Whew, so everything's working out. I'm so happy and yeah, today's gonna be good. I can feel it. Yes, every time the snow is falling down and it is cold outside, we gather around the I think are deciding on because they match really well with the dress I just picked out. Can you guys lower your music? We have a, a famous YouTuber. <laughs> oh my god, there's no way I can walk in these, but I think for no, photos. I feel like you can. It's not, it's just a block. That oh my god, it's so high. So cute though. You have to try on both to decide that though. I feel like you can because it's like a block heel. Your foot's not arched that much. Yeah, maybe. Let's we'll get the other one. Okay, let's go get it. My favorite holiday. Day two. Today we are taking graduation pictures. I did buy the dress yesterday. Yesterday that you guys saw that I got with Luana. We had actually just walked into the store and we immediately saw it and we're like, that's the one. And I love how it's just so sparkly. And to me, it really represents how important this graduation is to me. Like this is a huge deal and I wanna feel like what I'm wearing reflects how big of a deal this is. So I love that it's like completely over the top and it's not your standard white. And actually all of my friends are not wearing white. I don't know if that's like a Miami thing, but yeah. So we're just gonna have fun with it. And I have my two friends coming from my program. They have been my closest friends in this program since the very beginning. We had lab together and then after that we just stayed friends and helped each other out throughout the whole program. So they're gonna be here. They want me to do their hair and makeup. So I have my gown and cap and everything hung up over there. I tried to steam it the best I could. Um, and here are the shoes that you guys saw me buy. And then I have a makeup station here. This has the lashes the brushes and things that like I couldn't fit in my makeup bag with all the touch-up makeup. I love this for like contouring and the blush. Ugh. There we go. And this is the hair station. We have a curling iron, teasing brush, heat protector, and a hairspray. This is my camera equipment that I brought because we're not gonna pay $300 each to get photos done. We are gonna do photos ourselves. I also brought my tripod. This is the high quality camera I use for filming, used to use for filming tutorials. It is the A6000 Sony. And this is a special lens. It's like a $800 lens, 1.8. And then I also have this neutral density lens and you basically put it 
over this and it just helps to kind of filter out when there's too much sun, which I definitely think we're gonna be dealing with today. It's very sunny. I'm gonna charge my batteries, speakers so we can jam out. But yeah, guys, I'm so excited. And I also got this silver rope for being over, I think it was over a 3.65, but by the time I'm done, I'll have like a 3.8 something, I believe. Um, so yeah, pretty cool. My dress is under here. So I just tried to do my makeup before to match the dress. It's like this uh, coppery gold on the lids. Um, just curled my hair. I'm probably gonna curl some pieces again though. Um, I'm not gonna touch it, that's why it looks kind of funky. I'm just gonna let it chill until we actually start going out there, but the only thing that sucks is we have to walk around for everything. I wish we had like a little golf cart. We just finished getting ready and we're gonna be taking <laughs> pictures. So this is Courtney. Hi! And this is Adriana. Hi! Behind the pole. <laughs> So we already did our first um, photo shoot and it went really well. I had to teach Adriana how to use the camera, um, but we're doing good. And we're gonna show you guys like a little behind the scenes of how we get the pictures. We had a couple locations in mind, so we just went to them, set up the camera, and then took turns taking pictures of each other. Pretty easy. <laughs> Me too, it hurts already. So we're back guys um, at the nursing building and we're going to finish filming some TikToks that we filmed yesterday or no two days ago while we were in our scrubs. So here we go. Look there is good. Yeah. There we okay. Go. Perfect. So I'm going to pretty much almost be next to the wall. You're okay. going to be here and she's going to be here. And I so think... you really don't have to walk that far. <laughs> Courtney's just gone. I'm going to be the first one because I was the first one going down the stairs. Courtney's in the middle and you're the other side of them. You're like on okay. this side. I'm gonna take a picture, like a uh, screenshot. Oh. <laughs> My hat's falling off. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Every time. Every time. <laughs> Kelly, that should be your blooper. Yeah, I'll just leave it in. It's a filming party? Yeah. Oh. Hi. And then we, we walk away, right? No, no, this one, I'm just gonna do like this and just post. Where we it's two right? seconds long. Okay. And then I'm gonna go here, and then I'm gonna go like. I had to <laughs> Just that. I like it. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Yesterday we got a ton of awesome pictures and I came back home. I slept for like 12 hours. I feel like this whole past few weeks have just been go, 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 go. Absolutely zero sleep. I really felt like I needed to finally get sleep. So that's what I did last night. I have an appointment at 12.30 p.m. tomorrow for my hair to get a nice blowout for uh, my graduation. And I'll be hanging out with my dad and Chris tomorrow like all day pretty much after I get my hair done and then the day after that is my graduation so lots of stuff going on my mom is actually coming down with her boyfriend Rod as well so they will be able to make it and they already actually live in Florida they have a house in Florida so um, I think they're just gonna be coming down for the day on Tuesday so yeah I'm gonna finish cleaning and uh, here's Coda because you guys are all wondering how Coda is doing. She's doing amazing. She's been the best dog ever, my study buddy, throughout this whole program. I feel so bad all of the days, weeks, months that she was probably bored out of her mind because I couldn't go anywhere or do anything. I was just bound to the couch doing assignments, discussions, papers, exams, 
going to clinicals. Luckily, my boyfriend does live with me, though. So those of you who had questions about that, um, what happens with Coda when I'm gone for more than 12 hours of the day, my boyfriend is on opposite shifts than me, or the shifts that I had for um, clinicals were in the day, and then he works at night. So she was able to always have someone here with her at the house. Anyway, I love you, love you. <laughs> so I'm just going to... Do the bathrooms now while Coda lays down and watches me. <laughs> shining in right now so you can't really tell what's going on here but basically I need to get my ends trimmed and I would like to get a fresh blowout I'm not doing any color I haven't done color in I think since October 2020 I had dyed my hair like black so it has been a very long time I just kind of wanted to let my hair be and grow and it has which is amazing I've been taking biotin and uh, collagen but yeah other than that <laughs> um, I've been treating my hair really well and I was using the Olaplex I just ran out of it the, the thing was three and four but I also used six on my hair the smoother when I got out of the shower and I truly do feel like that made a difference in my hair and what I'm gonna try to do now is use what's it called oh I see it right here Bondi Boost, the shampoo and conditioner set. I got it from Amazon, this one right here. Um, we'll see how that goes. I heard that it gives like a lot more of a voluminous feeling, like more um, lift in your root area, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, today I'm here at Alexis Salon. She's my favorite. She's so sweet. There's something about her personality that like really clicks with mine. She knows what I want, but yeah, sometimes we like try out different cuts. Her specialty is blondes. So if you go to her Instagram account, you will see all these amazing transformations from like box dye to beautiful like balayage, like the painted kind of kind of balayage. Um, but yeah, for me, I'm just her boring brunette client, <laughs> and I always ask for a trim, uh, the face framing pieces and then some like curtain bangs. Lola. Lola baby girl. Lola baby girl. Hi. It's cold outside, but the fire keeps us warm. We can spend the night underneath the mistletoe. And I've gotten you a present that I put on Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. The snow is falling down, and the storm is on its way. But as long as you're around, everything will be okay. Cause all I want to do is spend this holiday with you. Tomorrow it is
So I finished steaming everything. Now I'm gonna do my makeup and hair. Gotta start off with a, with a good base. Well, just like on certain spots where I want some glow. And then this one is like the same texture from CoverGirl, the skin smoothing one, except it doesn't have like a bunch of sparkles in it. And I feel like it keeps my skin mattified. The maquillage, the lighting is terrible because my little light went out. I should have charged it last night. And I just do the slightest bit of this form this way. And then we're going to do Giorgio Armani. My eyes are so red. I didn't really sleep much. I was really anxious, I guess. Like, I'm excited that my family's going to be there. But at the same time, like, I hate being the center of attention. So it's just weird. Like, everyone's coming for me. Maybe my light will work for just a little bit. No. It's pretty bright. I love these. And I don't even think you can buy them anymore. From e.l.f. So I'm just using the crap out of them until I have to figure out something else that's similar. Um, but there's this one that's like a little more golden brown. I like to use that first since I'm so pale. I was going to self tan. But I just, something in me was telling me not to. Okay, now we're gonna go in a darker one. I'm gonna use the same brush. And just kinda chill out the cheekbones a little bit. And then lately from the same palette, this beautiful cream blush I've been absolutely loving. Do this neutral brown. All through the crease. I'm gonna use this darker brown. My trick is to get a little bit of powder, pressed powder, and kind of like go over this a little bit and just blend it all in perfectly those edges here in the inner corner and then up into the lid and I like this much more than a regular eyeshadow because it's so much more like pigmented because it's an actual foundation like it's a powder foundation 
So it covers more. And it gives you that like really bright eyed look. It Cosmetics Mascara, the superhero is the best one. I get, I have to say, I do. I get a lot of compliments on my eyes and my lashes when I wear this. And to powder, I just put my blender in there, wipe it off on the back of my hand so that it's smooth. And then I look down and press it in. Without smoothing it out, I take a crap ton and I bake under here because I, I feel like it makes the makeup look flawless in photos and for some reason that part of my face always looks darker I think because of the shadow of my cheekbone so I like to make sure that it's nice and bright for lips right now I'm just going to use this Be Peachy from Ace Butte So for highlight, they don't have this anymore. I need to find something similar, but these are e.l.f. booster drops. And I'm gonna mix them with my MAC strobe cream. And then I just quickly apply it to the cheekbone and up onto my brow bone. Brush this off now. And the last step that just like really melts everything in and makes it flawless is the Magic Radiance Fix Plus from MAC. And I spray like a lot. And I really don't want to get my hair wet. So <laughs> we're going to do this. Like, you want your face to be drenched in it. I'm really not even kidding. And then I use my wet sponge from earlier that had the foundation on it. And you just gently pat everything in. This is how the makeup turned out in natural sunlight. I have no filter on, so you can clearly see every single one of my pores. But I loved the way it turned out. So what I'm going to do now is put my hair extensions in. I just have three so these are like small two wefts that I put here for some extra volume and then this is like a longer third clip here that I put like right at the nape of my neck for some more volume at the bottom um, and yeah I'm just gonna curl it with this guy here this is the Luxie hair curling one and then I'm gonna get dressed but I have to charge you guys up so unfortunately you can't see the hair but you will see the outfit. Okay, so then I put my dress on, my gown, and um, what's it called? When you shake out the curls, did some hairspray, and that was it, guys. I wanted to thank all of you so much for sticking around with me and supporting me throughout this journey. I know it has been a very long time. I have been at this since 2020. <laughs> Um, and I'm so happy that I finally was able to get through. And I can't wait to up upload for you guys some more. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you soon. Yasmani Rodriguez. Isabella Garcia. Veronica De Leon. Kaylee Prince. Woo!